YouTube, what is up with y'all today? Snail Goodfella, Goodfella Nail coming through with another sneaker review. And I've seen this kick. Um it was it was it was it was kind of limited. I got mine off the sneakers app. I ended up getting them Kyrie 4 joints and mine is the Lucky Charm joints. And to me, man, this was like the best the best cereal uh uh collab for or the best cereal out of the three to four that came out. I know three came out. This Lucky Charms one. The Kicks and uh, the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. It's funny, out of all those, the best tasting cereal to me is the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. But I like the way these Lucky Charm joints look. And I think they look better than all of them. I did see the mini wheat joints that came out. Those are probably like third best, but I don't know. It's like a top between the mini wheat ones and the cinnamon toast crunch ones. The kicks ones, those just they just didn't really look that that great. It looked kind of plain. Um, so also too, man, I was just I'm gonna just show the kicks. But this is the box that it came in. Uh, beggars can't be choosers, I guess, though, man. I was under the impression that we was just gonna get like a damn the 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 cereal box packaging that that we actually seen on like the, now I know that they're the promotional pair or whatever or limited pair and those going for like six hundred to nine hundred or more or something like that um, on StockX and uh, I was disappointed like I really felt like the fuck you mean sex moves. Do, do I look like, uh, brother, I, I, you know, you're saying you haven't even tried any sex moves yet. Are you, are you, on live TV, I will fuck you up. Trust me. Well, I will fuck you up in here. Do you know that? Don't, I mean, don't you disrespect me by suggesting that. Suggesting that what? Suggesting that my answer might in some way make me less of a man in your eyes? I think you're less of a man for not answering. I think it's like a joke. <laughs> it was just a joke. You know what would be more of a joke? You know what would really be more of a joke? If the 24 hours ended right now. You understand? That would be more of a joke. Capitol Hill to work out a compromise health care plan, he lost his voice after his State of the Union speech. A roof collapsed at a supermarket in France. Soccer bopper, soccer bopper, more fun than a pillow fight. Blow him up. And watch, ready and get set, it's all back. I just couldn't believe that, like, I, I, I'm like, I, I was quick to pay. I'm like, oh man, I can't wait till they drop. I woke up, sneakers app, bang. Put in, all, you know, all my information, size 10. This is my first time ever even getting a Kyrie. Now I've been contemplating on getting them here and there because of like the colors and stuff. Uh, the colors are okay. And really the Kyrie is just one of those kicks that I just really just been passing up on because I've been like kind of like looking for a deal and stuff like that. So these just caught my eye real fast. I seen Jock Slade review these and that's where I first seen like the, the box and everything. And then once I got it and just got the plain box, man, I was like, 
I was happy as hell to spit out that spend that 120 plus shipping and tax it or whatever. Well, plus tax. Cause I'm thinking I'm getting a box, but man. Anyway. This is my first time ever having a Kyrie. I wear a size 10. So I end up getting sticking true to size with these. It felt different actually getting like a new basketball shoe, like from this era, cause y'all know me. Y'all could check all my videos, all my previous videos. I got nothing but um, you know, all the like classic stuff. You know what I mean? Air Max One, Jordan, all that stuff, right? Hirachi. Like, so it felt different wearing a, a new basketball shoe from this day and age. And um, it felt kind of like snug and stiff on the inside. I definitely bought this for looks because I really don't know what's what with the Kyrie for or any of the Kyries. I don't know if the previous ones fit like that, but they fit kind of tight to me, man. And I only just got a size 10. And you know I go nine and a half for a snug fit. So uh, definitely try these on in the store if you have it. Just, I'm talking about any Kyrie for but going off into it though man i definitely like this kick definitely it's one of those like fluorescent like kicks the color is uh bright crimson multicolor. now the thing is i asked somebody <laughs> what kind of shoe was this or what cereal would they associate with this shoe they said fruit loops and i can see where they're coming from with that i mean you got this bright green right here and then you know a few other bright colors lucky charms you could see it since they actually call it that the the whole mushroom I'm mean, mushrooms <laughs> marshmallows that at the bottom and stuff um, the traction look like it's pretty good this is probably like one of the best traction shoes I got damn near probably because you know again all my stuff like older kicks um, and then another thing too that I like not only just that they got this right here because it's definitely like a commemorative thing but another thing i like that they had was the inside where they got like the cereal actually on the sole on the insole and that that would just fly to me man like wow I like when they this this like what this is one of the many things that make collecting kicks cool, collecting and rocking them, stocking them and rocking them really, um, is because like you just get that 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 limited collab, uh, and it don't even have to be limited, like crazy limited. But the fact that like they this is just gonna be like blown away. This right here just look like Funland. This look like something like that kids are wear like the nieces are rock but um i feel like this is definitely one of them kicks that are definitely pop this is one of them kicks that you know definitely has its own personality and vibe in the collection if you don't too much care about bright kicks or whatever this is probably like you probably hate this another thing too i do like kind of remind me of pop tarts a little bit you got that speckled um mid sole It's almost kind of like how they do like the cherry pop tarts or the you no know, the strawberry ones or whatever when they just like put that sugar on the top of it or the white icing and stuff. Same thing they do with the blueberry. And a lot of people I see them tripping over what they call this swoosh color. It looks iridescent to me. That's why I'm gonna call it an iridescent swoosh. And you also do have a nice premium filling new buck or suede right here with the uh, cereal actually. Um, engraved or embossed on the mids on the upper rather this right here is not too much of my favorite part it's just like a big like it's just a big patch of hard mesh but I understand this is an athletic kick as far as the leather go right here it's, it's, it's very stiff but it's not too much of it so you know I'm cool with that um, laces only thing I would probably do if I do get another lace, is maybe just put a white lace in here. If that, just to break it up. Maybe it can like be the milk or something. I don't know. But um, I'm happy with these kicks the way they are. Definitely fly. Definitely flames, man. Um, yeah, I definitely had to pick up on these joints too, man. This is my first Kyrie. 
at the bottom it say fear is not real on the pod but and it says it on here as well so it's like right next to his number 11 so the crazy thing about this is like the regular gr pack that i got like i'm actually starting to see those damn near touch 160 to 200 damn near like the prices start going up for these i like that's crazy me i just genuinely copped i didn't i didn't want to you know i'm not doing it because it's hyped or whatever now i cop kicks and sometimes it just happened that they happen to be hyped and it's just funny man y'all can look at my all my videos and everything y'all could just tell like you know what i mean i definitely buy what i like also too man i like that good gold accent that they do got on the tongue a lot more things they got the general mills and then they got the illuminati eye on the back being for me oh also too going to the inner sock liner um it seems like more of a like a a, a matted like mesh just for like it's easy to slide in slide out pause and you got some of that mesh going along the collar of the shoe around the saga liner what do y'all think though man about these kicks i you know what though like i'm i'm still trying to get used to this lacing like they switching it up as far as the lace they got the ropes right here i seen the lebron do this like in the early 2010s and i know that's a new way they do shoes now like nike or whatever they put the for shoe like I'm about to cut the lacelets not the lacelets the uh lace loopholes so yeah it got more like that bungee kind of like cord and then along the top you also don't have that but yeah man i'm this kick though yeah as far as like fits with the wear with this i wouldn't wear nothing i just keep it solid at the top and then just let the kicks do all this all the talking um you know i wear like a gray uh like gray pants like jogger like just about almost any jogger just keep it plain and solid and this will work uh, a simple all black fitter just be cool with this maybe a gray tee or something like that and you know like green tee maybe forest green I might be close but yeah man this one is where the kicks do a lot of talking and a lot of the statements also too uh, as well the tongue has a mesh stay tuned i'm gonna have like a whole week of sneakers man just kicks and all that i've been editing my ass off just getting video ready and stuff sneaker marathon starting soon i just wanted to say that in one of my videos just so i can let it be known because i'm about to be coming with the heat man back to back to back to back to back um as far as like post them videos damn near for like a week straight so get ready for that i got another video dropping tomorrow too as well another sneaker video um i don't know man i might find time to maybe place in a talk video just to give y'all a, a quick break on the sneaker stuff kicks that could damn near make uh well i would say it made my top 10 for this year instantly um could it be possibly top five? Maybe for the simple fact of collab purposes, but I'm not, I, I buy what I like. I, Cause I, it's hard for me to have a top five collabs of the year. I don't cop every collab. Cause even the ones I do like, they be hard to get. So rate, comment and subscribe. This is Neil Goodfella, Goodfella Neil, coming through with another review. The Kyrie four joints, Lucky Charms. And again, stay tuned. I got nothing but sneaker videos coming right after this for a week straight. Yeah, thanks for watching, liking, and subscribing, commenting, all that stuff. Peace.